Welcome back to Real Milwaukee. You know what? I cannot tell you how many times I've told myself it's just one little bite. I tell myself that all the time because I want to try everything, right? right. But uh, it turns out that might not be good for us. Our registered dietitian, Lisa Gredzelanik, joins us today with a reality check. Mm. Yes, because those little bites, Lisa, they add Bite up to big back. calories, yes, right? They, they really can. And now, you know, it's kind of like I'm talking out of both sides of my mouth when I say, okay, well, if you want to sample something, have a bite. You know, if it's something you're saying, like you go to a party, right. you want to have a little of everything. Yeah, you're just right. grazing. That can work. But now what I'm talking about is your routine day. If you're kind of in this um, black hole of certain calories don't count and certain food doesn't mm -hmm. count, that can add up. So I like to encourage my clients, if they have some mystery weight gain going on or some yeah. mystery pounds. Yeah, because you never right. understand where like, it comes from. Where is from. it coming from? <laughs> right. Then you need to start right. looking Write at how many down. BLTs you're eating. Yeah. Yeah. So BLTs, bites, licks, and tastes. Oh, oh okay. Not the sandwich, even bites, bites, licks, and tastes. Sniffs, sniffs are really? okay though, right? Sniffs, that's a good one, Cassandra. I'm going to use that. Sniffs are good. Okay. So let's look at something this time of year that gets all of us. Mm -hmm. You go past your coworker's desk and you swipe Two All of those the mini Snicky, yes, Snickers. Especially what Halloween. could this mini two. Snickers do to right? anybody? So, how picks? many calories are in two, two, two mini little Snickers? I, I'm afraid. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm going to say, yeah, I'm gonna right yeah, say 86. I'm going to say um, um, C. Okay, it's B. 86 and two of those little guys. Do you know how easy it is to blow Just back four pop or them in five your mouth. Right. If you have six of those little guys, you had 250 calories. You would have to walk an hour to burn those six little, you know, treats off. Ooh. So that little bit adds up. You're gonna have one or two, yeah. but and that's the kind of thing that you eat and you don't even. Well, I'll speak for myself. I yeah. don't even remember that right. I ate it after the show. Right. You're gonna have a couple here. Or yeah. I'll just grab a few. It's like it yeah. just isn't even enter into right. your brain. Right. Because it's not real food. It's like yeah. I didn't real. Okay. It's just a little bit. Mm -hmm. All, All right. right. What failed. about peanut butter? So we, you know, a lot of us like peanut butter at home. And let's just say you're right. making a big old, you know, a nice peanut butter and jelly sandwich, and then you have some peanut butter left on oh, your. Oh, I love that. And you lick that off. Well, right? you gotta clean the spoon. Right. right. Well, how much would you be taking calories? Wise, if you just licked off that spoon of peanut butter, 30, mm. 60, or 90 calories? I'm going to say 60. I'd say 90. 90 calories. Oh. So one tablespoon of Man. peanut butter, 90 calories. Wow. So all of a sudden, if I had a couple Snickers and the peanut butter, now I got extra, you know, 300 calories that I wasn't thinking about. And it's not simply about calories, but you have to be burning what you're taking in. Right. So it can offset it's like your... simple science. And we simple don't math. typically move more than we typically mm -hmm. move. So we're not necessarily moving yeah. more to accommodate it. Now what? So this time of year, we make cookies, this, right? And what do you do? We make and that's a little bit of cookie dough. Cookie lick, right? Yeah. So how many calories in two licks of the spoon? Fifty, fifteen calories, thirty or sixty calories, and two simple little licks. I'm gonna licks? say, say I'm gonna say thirty because it's too. not really a cookie. Me too. Yet. It's right? sixty. Oh, oh man! 60. Now, let, me, let, me, let me really blow your mind. <laughs> this sugar? amount of cookie That's dough just enough cookie to make me mad. It's 120 calories in that little bit. So I don't know about you guys, but if I was licking the bowl, I'd probably eat at least that much, which is 120 calories. 17 That's carbs. Just wrong. So that could be real. How much sugar is in that, you think? Yeah, it's the 17 carbs. I think the sugar was about 14 grams or so. So oh. it's it's a little bite and of sugar. And you only need like okay. 20 some grams of sugar. <laughs> right. Let's talk okay. about something so that would bacon. definitely get me yeah. in trouble. Bacon. So everything tastes better with bacon, right? Yeah. Yes. You go out to eat, you're better. like, ah, oh, the heck with it. Let's just put the bacon on. How many calories in your two slices of bacon? 50, 90, or 125? I'm going to say 125. I'd say 90. 90 calories. Not so all not too bad. Not too not horrible. You know, it depends you on your protein. thickness of it and so forth. And you know what? To be on honest, it might be worth it for you to have the bacon on there, and make it taste I was about good. to say it's just protein. But, yeah. You know, so you know we can go with the bacon. Okay. Then right. what about this? So the uh. kiddos, you have some toddlers, and they didn't finish their meal. This is very classic for parents. And what do you do? You eat what the kids didn't eat. Mm -hmm. So here we have I a half-eaten cheeseburger and just a couple of fries. There's 15 fries on there. Okay, very common that you might just swipe that up. You don't want to toss it in the garbage. How many calories are we talking about here? 150, 205, or 265? I'm going to say 265. Yeah, 265. 265. Yeah. So again, are you walking an hour to and burn that's off not, that? And that's not going to fill you up. That's no. like four bites. That's None even. of this is filling you up. No. That's an addition to which you already consumed at your more meal. Hungry. So that can All right. add up. Orange juice is good okay. for you. So you got a little of that orange juice in the carton of mine as well. Just use it. You know, why waste it? So it's a half a cup of orange juice that was left that's in there. That's just a half a half cup. Half a cup that was left in the container. Now, how many additional needless calories are you consuming with that half a cup? Just so you don't leave that in the fridge, right? Right. <laughs> 55, 75, or 95? I'm going to say 55. Let's go 95. 
So we're gonna go 55 oh. calories. Uh -huh. So, you know, another little not bit there, bad. you're not horrible. But right. again, did you need the half a cup? Did you not? Right. You know, it's something you get to decide. Let's talk about the real Here's so my problem. This yeah. is yeah. addicting. Yeah. So One chip I turns just into had a few back. chips. I hear this all the time. Mm -hmm. Just a few. Again, it's this black hole of oh, it's a couple right. of them, so it doesn't matter. Right. That's ten chips. How many calories are roughly in a handful and that's of a, chips? That's a serving, wouldn't that be? I'm going to say 100. Ugh. So 100 to 105 calories. So right. B is the correct answer. So an easy thing to think about here is each chip is about 10 calories. Oh! Each chip. So if you say, oh, I'm just having a few chips, and you grab, you know, 10 chips, that's 100 calories. And See, they're so addicting, then you're going to want my, And so my, my way to doing all this is I don't even start, because one, right. one chip, mm -hmm. one one lick, one, it's a gateway. Right, and so you kind of like, got to know how you are. Right. I have some folks that say, well, it. I can have one or two, and some say, no, 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 no. I have to have, you know, half a bag of chips if I get in the chips, or I need to have several cookies. So those bite licks and tastes really can add up. So if only even for, you know, a few days, you take some awareness of mm -hmm. everything you're putting on the end of your fork or you're putting in your mouth. That Do can like really, I've been doing lately. Write it down. You will be shocked. It you, can really be You'll be, be shocked into kale. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Lisa G, thank you so much. Always great information, yes. whether we want to hear it or not. Right. We'll be right back.